Yeah. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. Today I'm dropping an attribute video update for you guys. A lot of people have been asking me about my attributes, about my move sets, about a lot. And just to let you guys know, nothing really has changed much from my last attribute video. But uh, I'm gonna go ahead and end this shoot around and uh, show you guys a few things real quick. So first off, for the attributes, I am a 88 overall. I've only went to live practice maybe four times. My gym rat badge is halfway full, maybe a little bit more than half. But uh, as you guys can see, I have 21 gold badges. I'll just show you what badges I currently have. Now, um, just a little disclaimer, I'm not playing on rookie casual. So if you guys are looking for some badges that you should see like dead eye, limitless range, badges like that, I'm not there yet. I won't be getting those badges until I get better. Now, uh, what I can tell you is the badges that I do have, I earned them. Um, but there is a new list out that 2K has put out on Operation Sports where it tells you how to get every single badge. I'll leave that link inside the description for you guys. You know what I'm saying? Make sure that you know you check that out. Um, endorsements. Let's check out endorsements real quick. Let me just check my inbox. Uh, look at that. Look at that. Got me a billboard. From Stan Socks. Look at that. Thank you from Gatorade. Gave me a t-shirt. Wonder what that t-shirt all about. You know what? Let me nah, you know what? I ain't gonna worry about that. This is an attribute video, not a clothing update video. But uh let's check out my NBA animations. My jump shot is currently Rudy Gay. I'm looking to change that very, very soon. Um Rudy Gay just sticks for me a little bit too much sometimes. I have it on quick, so maybe that's the reason why it sticks. Um, my free throw should be, yes, it, there it is, uh, Kevin Durant. Um, my dunks that I have, yo, I'm like I'm like a mini Westbrook out here, B. Um, I got under the basket regular. Uh, I have sidearm tomahawks, straight arm tomahawks, cockback tomahawks. And is there anything else I have? No. Let's check out my layup. Um, I think, yeah, my layup is Steph Curry. Um, I'm thinking about taking that off and going with Westbrook. Not sure yet. I'll think about that soon. Uh, my pregame, don't really have a pregame yet. Yeah, I'm, I just haven't had time for it, man. I just, I don't really care much for it. Maybe I will try something with a jump ball rit ritual, but you know, you never know. Um, my park animations, uh, look at that, 25% off so celebrations. Oh, look at that. Um, little no look, uh, wizard. Okay, let's see. Don't got nothing there. Oh, look at the VC cuts right there. Look at that. Look at that. everything else is locked. Who cares? Um, but what I do have is my post game dance. You guys would probably laugh at me. It's all right though. Let's check it out. This is, this is my dance. This is how I get it down, man. This is how I get it down when I'm at the park when I get that win. You know what I'm saying? No taunt of uh, sing signature introduction. Come on, man. I'm, I'm like Creed, man. I told y'all, man. I'm on my Creed, man. I'm doing my thing, but uh, let's check out some signature styles for your boy. Contested shot is currently Dirk. I don't know why it's Dirk, but uh, I'm going to go ahead and change that to Steph Curry. Uh, my triple pull up is Steph Curry. Uh, my spin jumper is on normal. It should be Steph Curry, but the reason why I don't like Steph Curry is because it's a little bit too slow, and most people at the park can catch up to you, so I got it on normal, where it just looks like I'm doing a regular spin move, but then I pull up into a shot. Uh, my hop jumper is Steph Curry, though, you know what I'm saying? I like the hop jumper from Steph. I do like others, but I'm just going to stick with Steph's for now because it creates a lot of space. My post fade is Michael Jordan. Post hook is Shaquille O'Neal. Yeah, I'm a beast in the paint. Uh, my hop shot is um, one, shimmy shot is one, protect jumper one, uh, my dribble posture is upright. I don't know why it's on upright, maybe it's on upright because I changed it to try to get crossovers in the upright position, but I'm going to go back to default. Uh, my crossover is number six, guys. My crossover is number six. My behind the back is number seven. A lot of people ask me about that behind the back. If you guys never seen an animation, something's wrong with you. I see that animation all the time at the park. People stay using that. My ISO spin is seven. The reason why I made it ISO spin seven is because when he does a crazy spin like this, you can either keep going with the spin, cut back, all different kinds of things, man. You can do whatever you want. My hesitation is number three. My hesitation really isn't that crazy. I really don't use my hesitation that much, except for when I do that, when I jump back, you know, that's that's mainly what that hesitation is for. When you jump back like that and you create space, you could do a combination of moves. It's insane. My signature size up is nine. 
The reason why my signature size up is nine is because I haven't found a signature size up that I like. And this is the one that I had last year. You go between the legs twice and give a little cross. You can do whatever you want. You can drive, you can step back, you can spin out of that. You can do a bunch of different things with that size up because it's simple. Now my ISO size up inside out is Jamal Crawford. We all know about this one. Everybody kind of dictates when a person is doing that size up. Everybody knows that by now. Um, but my ISO size up cross, which everybody has been asking me about, is the Kyrie Irving. You step back. Now, when you're using this against the computer, it's cheese because you can run right around the computer because they automatically get stunned. But against regular people, you got to either cross back or throw behind the back one time. Um, my ISO size up escape. Kyrie Irving, I'm telling y'all right now, this ISO size up escape puts people on their butt. A lot of people fall from this ISO size up. Um, I got all of my drinks from Kel Hit 'em Up, man. It, it, it was it was what was needed, man. But uh, my mannerisms, dunk emotion, chewing gum. Uh, I don't think that my lips are working. Oh, there we go. And back to that. Now let's go to Arena Media. Uh, when it comes to Arena Media, I gotta come out to where I'm from by Hove. It's only right. You know what I'm saying and boost um I don't do the boost thing that's that's not really my my, my forte but uh, if you want to get in boost man I, I I'm not hating not at all um what's next my connections I know a lot of people probably want to know what's up with my connections my fans everything like that so my teammate chemistry is 85 I have over 1.6 million fans and I've unlocked just about every connection um I haven't really chosen to do any really because i wanted to get my uh my endorsements up so that's why i really haven't been doing too many connections maybe i'll do those in my second season um i'm gonna probably keep working in live practice mainly to try to get the 99 my goal is to get the 99 overall with this player i don't want to keep wasting time and you know not playing as many games as i usually do and what else do we have okay let's so let's go to my uh yeah let's go to my minutes why not um you guys can see that i get 38 minutes on the floor 38 minutes man god darn that's a lot of minutes um now let's check out league leaders i'm currently leading in points per game that's because your boy's nice i'm just I'm just gonna go ahead and uh point that out real quick um let's see uh player that seems stats with you for let's go to division standings uh we are currently Bazzing on the league right now. Those seven games that we lost, man, they were tough, man. They were going. I was going up against people in Hall of Fame, and they were just cheesing. I don't know what it was, but man, it's all it's all right. But uh, currently, award races. I'm currently in the lead for MVP. I'm going to try to keep that that way. Uh, all star voting. Um, your boy is number one on that list with 1.6 million votes for the backcourt in the Eastern Conference. Now, the funny thing is, Russell Westbrook and Steph Curry. Well, not Steph Curry, but Russell Westbrook has more votes than me. So that, that goes to show you that he's a monster. That just means that I need to get more crossovers and dunks like him so I can get my fan base up. Um, season awards, this is how it's basically looking. I have been on a tear. Um, so basically what I do is um, I've been using the three-quarter sim out. Um, you guys noticed that in my last video um, when I basically try to be LeBron James and get frustrated with my team and just sit out. But uh, yeah, I've been I've been going on a tear lately. Um, as for NBA records, um, like I told you guys, no rookie casual for me. So I'm not breaking many records. Um, all I've broken is the steals record. The reason why I had that many steals on that game is because the ball is just so disrespectful and, and just so tangible. And then, you know, me playing the passing lanes, like the steals is just so easy to get on this game. If you don't get steals in this game, something is wrong with you. The ball literally falls off of people's legs like no problem like all you got to do is say hey man hey hey tie your shoe and when he looks down the ball just go comes loose i'm telling you now but uh this is the main thing that i'm not trying to get i'm not trying to get the most turnovers in nba history my god it's insane about how many turnovers people get but um all these records i will try to break i probably will break those in my second uh year well i'm sorry third year you know because the first year was a fluke um and that's really about it man um i'm playing a hall of fame simulation 12 minutes uh the game speed i put it on 50 because i really don't care um my number is 47 now check this out y'all a lot of people have been like trying to kill me like yo bro why don't you change your number back to 15 look what happens when i try to go to 15 it's gone 2k does not let you get any numbers that have been retired anymore 
So, and, and this is the worst thing. Like, either I'll be like Russell Westbrook or Gilbert Arenas, or I can be number 11, number 12, number 14, 16, 17, 18, 19. Like, I don't, I don't like none of these numbers. Like, even 23. I know this MJ number. I'm really, really not feeling it. Like, I'm not feeling it. KD number, really not feeling it. Like, I'd rather be the ball-headed bandit and be Agent 47. I'm the hitman out there now. That's what you guys can call me from now on. I'm the hitman. Very awkward. Number 47. Doing it big. Um, for controls. No, not control. Controller settings. This is what I play on. I play on with the vibration. Default pro stick. Absolute on everything. Um, icon leading. Passing. My pass right stick should be uh, flashy. But I leave it on normal because I play the computer a lot. And I don't, I don't want to just f up what i'm doing now pass target presets i always put it to openness i never have it on direction because if you have it on direction you're going to get people cut into the basket when you don't want them to cut to the basket or you know because whatever way you're running that's what um direction or player run as long as your analog is facing that certain way so i tend not to mess with things like that but uh yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video nice little attribute update um, just to let you guys know, I will be probably giving you guys the all-star game very soon. Um, I'm, I'm working on that right now. Uh, I just got to do my whole little, you know, get three quarters, get up 11 points and then sim out. But, um, I've been missing a lot of perfect releases, uh, 2K. I just wanted to, wanted to put that out there. I've been missing a lot of perfect releases and I'm just going to let y'all know now, the more perfect releases I, I miss the more insane i feel about this game's dream release factor like i feel like if we're gonna miss them just take them out of the game you know if they're not gonna be all net just 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 take the green bar out of the game just take it out we don't need it it's no reason for it because it gets too many people's hopes up when when they shoot a green release and they miss like do you understand how a person feels when they miss a green release like it's like their entire world ended and you know how hard it is to get a green release online gaming like oh my god it's insanely hard to get a green release so i know when i get my green releases i want to make them every single time that's just the way i feel i don't know man um let me know how you guys feel in the comment section how you feel about the green release and how you know you tend to miss some sometimes and or whatever the case may be um but i will let you guys know that um i missed a green release before i started recording this video and uh as an outro i'm gonna go ahead and put that video clip in all right you guys i'll holla at y'all